Since her release date back in 2016, Nurse has been consistently the best killer in the game, with the only competition being Spirit and Blight at their peak. However, as of the making of this video, she is still the best killer in the game and by quite a long shot. Sure, Hillbilly and Blight are still good, but they really don't compare to Nurse. The reason she's always been so strong is that even though her movement speed is slower than Survivor's, she is the only killer that can straight up ignore pallets and windows, which are the Survivor's main line of defense. Sure, she's strong now, but she used to be even stronger. I remember when on Nurse you could have 5 blinks if you use add-ons. So over time, she's pretty much only gotten worse and is still the best killer in the game by quite a long shot. Although many of her add-ons have been nerfed over the years, her actual base kit has only had very minor nerfs happen to her throughout the years. Especially in the last few years, Nurse has barely even been touched except for some bug fixes and some add-on changes. And if you look at Behavior's roadmap for the next few months they have a lot of killers being tweaked and none of them are nurse and they haven't said anything about her being changed at all so why why does behavior not want to change nurse she is not some licensed dlc character that would be hard for them to change she's their own original character and for the longest time she's easily been the best killer in the game she's the only killer that can ignore pallets and windows and she's also the only killer that's slower than survivors to make up for this extremely good power my little conspiracy theory is that they keep nurse strong to stop killing from complaining. Now why? Why do they do this and is it even effective? Well tell me if you've had an experience like this or you've known someone that's had an experience like this. You play a relatively weak killer or a kind of strong killer but with not a strong build and you get destroyed. You play against let's say a four man swift and they have amazing perks, they all communicate really well and you just get destroyed and you feel so mad because they're, they're teabagging you at the gates, they're smack talking you in the post game chat and you are just pissed. In that moment of rage your thoughts are wow survivors are broken i need to play a really good killer so i can keep up since they have all these broken perks that i just can't compete with and so what do you do you go on nurse and you run for slowdown unfortunately i used to be guilty of this mindset ever since then i always just take a second and i'm like you know this next group that i'm about to go against they're not the ones that did this to me so i just usually try to relax realize it's just a game and move on because i don't want to take my anger out on some random group of four solo queue survivors that are just trying to chill and they're not even bringing good stuff and they're not and a lot of them are probably new but still even though my theory is kind of out there just think about it killers can't say that killer is not the power role as long as nurse exists in her current state even someone like me with limited experience on nurse can do really well with her even without slowdown perks i've had times where i've played nurse where it's just like barbecue and chili like just one perk and i can consistently win because she is just that good and a lot of her add-ons even though they used to be a lot worse a lot of her add-ons are still really really good and as survivor she is so frustrating to go against what you'll often hear is that people will say oh just cut off line of sight but good nurses they know what to do against this let's say you're a survivor and you turn a corner while this nurse is waiting for her blinks to come back what some nurses will try to do is try to blink through the wall after you've turned the corner and try to guess where you are what a good nurse will do is she will blink to the corner see where you are and then adjust using her other blink against a good nurse i'm not saying there's zero counterplay but there is very little and sometimes Sometimes as killer, if you've had a frustrating game, this can feel really nice and rewarding. You kind of finally feel like the scary killer power role. Now, my entire conspiracy theory could just be wrong, and they don't want to nerf Nurse because she is kind of hard for beginners, and most people that play this game are actually pretty casual. So I can see why they might not want to change a killer that the average person would probably struggle with. Since she moves slower than survivors, I think we've all gone against the nurse that's having a hard time with her blinks, so that she'll just try to get you just M1. But but she doesn't know that the nurse is slower than survivor, so you just go around the loop forever until they try to use their blink again and then they mess up because it's hard. I think we've all been in that situation. So maybe that's it and it's just not my crazy conspiracy theory. But regardless of which reason it is that they haven't touched nurse, I think they should just make nurse a 110 killer and just nerf her blinks. For example, make it so she has two or three blinks, but they can't go through walls. That would make her kind of similar to Blight, but it would also make her fit in with other killers. We're pushing on 40 killers now and nurse is still very unique which some people will like but again any survivor perk windows of opportunity a lot of exhaustion perks won't aren't really that effective against nurse a perk like smash hit is almost useless chemical traps almost useless and that also goes for killer perks too why would you run enduring there's a bamboozle nurse meme but again bamboozle is terrible she ignores a lot of perks and a lot of the gameplay design so why not make her like a 110 or a 115 killer and just greatly nerf her power so she fits in a little bit more and that would also be 
better for beginners since she wouldn't be slower than survivors. I get that some people really like how strong Nur Nurse is right now, but wouldn't you say that a better direction would be for them to balance killers as a whole instead of just relying on Nurse being strong to be like, well, we're gonna be lazy, we're not gonna change this thing because Nurse exists. But let me know if you disagree or if you agree. And yeah, thanks for watching everyone. Peace. I think this thing is not good for your hair.